Nigerian Air Force training aircraft crashes in Kaduna. Officers fear dead. Oh my God, this is a very sad one. A training aircraft of the Nigerian Air Force, NAF, has crashed in Kaduna State. Several officers are feared to have been killed in the plane crash, which occurred on Tuesday. While the details of the incident remain sketchy, two pilots were on board. Cable reports. The incident comes barely a year after General Ibrahim Atayuru, the former chief of army staff, died in a plane crash in the same state. Atayuru and other military officers were killed when their plane crashed as it was about to land at the Kaduna International Airport on Friday, May 21st, 2021. The armed forces had said in a statement that the, the crash claimed the two lives of 10, I beg your pardon, claimed the lives of 10 other officers, including the crew. Bad news every day in Nigeria. There is no day you will not hear bad news. Every day. So our ear, they, they forbid to hear bad good news for this country. Every day by day, we must hear bad news. God, have mercy on this country. Meanwhile, Nigerians have reacted to this. Truly, God is wonderful, even making them to kill themselves. Oh my God. To show that innocent blood wasted in evil state are crying to God, and God cares for them. Is God not wonderful? He said. Whenever you kill innocent people in Biafra land, like the killings in Imo state, God will give you more. Thank God, something else kills Nigerian force. I think they have power in the East, killing and burning people's properties in the name of fighting ESN. Plot to disseminate Nigerian military to overrun Nigeria's system. May God save and bless good people of Nigeria. ESN and IPOP is to be blamed. They cause it. They send their remaining soldiers down to East immediately. Hmm, I said it. They must always find a way to waste the billions of dollars spent on equipment. The other day I was shot down my I was shot down my bandits rather than using them on terrorists. Okay, I don't really know what it means by that. They know what they are doing. Guys, these are reactions by Nigerians. Kaduna State. Because Governor Erufai single handedly changed God's approved leadership pattern of Muslim Christian ticket. They become God for second state. They should go back to what can provide them peace and progress. They have some infrastructures, pockets of progress now, but a void of peace. But void of peace, okay. Things we love to hear, <laughs> really. Things they say South Easterners will not have peace. Our God will always continue to fight for us. Bandit attacked train in Kaduna, killed some, kidnapped some. Around the village, within the incident, no military operation. In Olo, in the name of looking for ESN, who are not even troubling the village people, the innocent people's houses were burned. Innocent people were killed. Then tell me what kind of double standard and base is this and this is one nigeria in a particular tribe can be killed anyhow and nothing will happen we have governors we have senators representatives even organizing the will everybody just keep quiet it is well but god day my mind is telling me it was shot down by bandits okay after they are still after they will still order for more fighter jets, innocent blood wasted out of carelessness from the government. This is really very bad. Though. Is this country, we will never know what truly happened to Fiakwa. It is this also how calamities line up to before other countries. Okay, someone asked, hmm, or oh, girl, single good news 
in Nigeria again, I beg. Every day, bad, bad news. Please, God, come and heal our land, though. This is getting too much. My observation, anytime, is that the extrajudicial killing in the South is there will be military crash or one misfortune against Nigerian military. Life is really unfair to Nigerian soldiers. I felt sorry to their families, so I hope they compensate the families they left behind. Okay, now, sorry, story for the guards. Everyday bad news in this country. So, we cannot hear good news again. We cannot hear good news again because we have bad people in the country and who are leading this country, he said. Military will say we are on top of the situation. National Assembly will say we condemn this act. The presidency will say we are re- informing our security architecture. Nigeria, I hail on una too much. I beg I sorry for this nation. IPOP, why now? You blame IPOP for this, please, since they are the problem facing Nigeria. Okay. Uh, why is military so falling? God save Nigeria. What? This is a very bad news. It's a very good news to me. Kama is really true. The innocent blood Nigerian military killed on Easter in Imo states, you know, are actually speaking. End Nigeria and save life. You refuse. More are still coming. Okay, guys. These are some reactions by Nigerians. Honestly, this is a very bad one. May their soul rest in peace. May their perfect soul rest in peace in Jesus' name. I'm dropping it here, guys. Kindly share your thoughts with us below the comment section. Don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Thank you very much for this. Have you here? Bye for now.